Hi everybody, welcome to my channel, Long Dad. Planting vegetables in pots has some advantages, but it also comes with some issues. Today I'm going to talk about some of my findings. Now all my tomatoes, uh, okras, eggplants were in um, pots. Once the blossom started, I noticed some of the blossom ends for my tomatoes were rotting. After a little investigation, I found out how the roots of some of my plants in pots were above the ground like veins. Now, I was already aware that watering shallow forces the roots to come up to get nourishment. Hence, I was intentionally watering deep to my knowledge. So when I noticed this vein-like root system to quite a few of my plants, especially the pot-bound ones, I was quite surprised. It took me some deeper investigation into the soil structure of the pots to find the truth. When I filled out the pots, while I used topsoil and compost for most of them, in some I had put clay soil from my garden, mixed with topsoil and compost to save on cost. Those clay soil became lumped inside the pots, obstructing water to flow easily and causing the water to pool on top. That happening over days caused the roots to venture up and eventually that caused the blossom end rot for tomatoes. The solution was easy. I loosened up the soil in those pots as much as I could without damaging the plants, took out some of the shallow roots and started to make sure that I watered them until water flew down the bottom, confirming that water reached all the way bottom. This technique worked and very soon I noticed the root system re-established and the bottom rot in tomatoes disappeared. So something to remember if you are doing pot gardening or taking shortcuts when preparing soil.